Well, that didn't. Last long, she's been dispossessed quicker than you can see. Male counterattack. The defender barely had to try. That's pure class from him. That's pure class from her. That's pure class from them. What the hell was that? What the heck was that? What happened there? What happened there? What happened there? Absolutely awful ball control. Terrible ball control. I can't believe they're trying to control the ball still. Ball control could do with some improvement. Ball control is getting better. Ball control needs a little work. Ball control is stunning. Look at that display of ball control from them. Look at that display of ball control from him. Look at that display of ball control from her. Ball control is a master class. A master class in ball control. A true master class in ball control. Watch and learn. The pro is at work. Look at that masterful ball control. Everyone at home. Watch and learn how a pro handles the ball. Absolute control over the ball. Perfect ball control from them. I can't believe he thinks he's dribbling. I can believe he calls that dribbling. Oh no. Oh dear God, why the humanity please end their suffering? I can believe she thinks she's dribbling. I can believe she calls that dribbling. Oh no. Why on earth would they let him dribble? Oh no. Oh dear God, why the humanity please end the fans' suffering? Oh no. Why on earth would they let her dribble? Oh, oh God, why have you allowed this to happen? Did I not pray enough in church? The dribbling is absolutely awful. It will disgrace. A violation of the Geneva Conventions. Someone get them off the pitch. Their dribbling is an undesignated crime against humanity. I can't believe he thinks he's dribbling. I can't believe he calls that dribbling. Oh no, oh dear God, why? The humanity please end their suffering. I can't believe she thinks she's dribbling. I can't believe she calls that dribbling. Oh no, why on earth would they let him dribble? Oh no, oh dear God, why the humanity please end the fans' suffering? Oh no, why on earth would they let her dribble? Oh, oh, oh God, why have you allowed this to happen? Did I not pray enough in church that dribbling is absolutely awful? It loathes a disgrace. A violation of the Geneva Conventions. Someone get them off the pitch. Their dribbling is a crime against humanity. What a disgrace that dribbling might be a violation of the Geneva Conventions. Oh, 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 no. Someone get them off the pitch. Their dribbling is a crime against humanity. ...could do with work. Wait, wait, oh no, they're putting in a decent effort, but their dribbling needs work. Wait, wait, oh no, they were a little out of practice with their dribbling. Oh no, don't do it. They seem out of practice with their dribbling, but I can see the effort. Oh no, don't do it. Putting in an average dribbling performance. Oh, oh, I am not sure that'll work out. Oh, 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 oh no, oh no. Dribbling at an acceptable level. Oh, 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 oh no, oh no, oh no. His dribbling is passable at best. Oh, 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 oh no. Oh no, her dribbling is passable at best. Oh no, don't do it. Their dribbling is possible at best. He scores. It's a goal. It's a goal. Their dribbling is possible. She scores. It's a goal. It's a goal. It's a goal. I think their team can live with that dribbling skill. There are a lot of effort at the very least. And they score. It's a goal. It's a goal. It's a goal. Oh, look at him go. He's making those defenders question all their life choices. By the end of this run, they will be applying for new jobs. He's dribbling through defenders like they were not even there. Honestly, at this point, he could dribble past airport security without setting off any alarms. The defenders are trying, bless them, but he's out here like he's playing a private game of solitaire. Just him, the ball, and a lot of confused faces. He's dancing through the defense like a ballerina on fast forward. You almost expect him to take a bow and ask for a standing ovation once he's done. Well, I hope those defenders bought their GPS because they are officially lost. He's turned them inside out, upside down, left them in another postcode. He's dribbled past three defenders like they were holograms. I'm not sure if they were trying to tackle him or politely offering him the ball back. At this point, you have to wonder if the ball is controlling him. At this point, you have to wonder if the ball is controlling him. It becks like watching a magician who's made the defenders disappear and reappear somewhere far, far away. Or pretty sure I just saw one of the defenders turn to the referee and ask if they can switch to a different sport. It's getting ridiculous out there. Is he dribbling? Or is this interpretive dance? Either way, the defenders are mesmerized and all I'm missing is some dramatic music to complete the performance. It's like the ball is his pet dog, loyally following him wherever he goes, while the defenders just chase after like they are trying to catch a stray. He's made those defenders look like they were moving in slow motion, and I'm pretty sure I just saw one of them check to see if their boots are tied together. At this point, you have to wonder if the ball is controlling him. It was like watching a magician who has made the defenders disappear and reappear somewhere far away. He's gliding past the defenders so effortlessly. It was like they've agreed to let him through in exchange for autographs after the match. I haven't seen dribbling like this since I left my dog alone with the hosepipe. The defenders are slipping, sliding, and he's just strolling through like he's out for a Sunday walk. The defenders have formed a search party to find the ball, but he's already left the building. At this point, I wouldn't be surprised if they started 
asking the crowd for directions. He's weaving through defenders like a seamstress with a needle. By the time he's done, we'll have a new line of football inspired fashion on the runway. Oh dear, they're trying to get through the defense, but it's more like trying to push through a brick wall with a wet noodle every time they attempt to dribble. The ball seems to develop a mind of its own and runs off to join the defenders. At this rate, I wouldn't be surprised if the ball starts filing a missing person's report on their behalf. Oh, oh, well, oh no, oh why, well, they're giving it a go. But getting past these defenders is proving about as effective as swimming upstream in molasses. Every touch seems a little too heavy, and the ball's acting like it's ready to break free and run for safety. You've got to admire the effort, but the ball retention, let's say it's there, it's much more work in progress. Oh, oh well, oh no, oh why? They were making progress, but it like a bit like threading a needle in the dark. There's some stumbling and a couple of defenders are hanging on like they've just missed the last bus home. To their credit, they are holding onto the ball, but you can almost hear the defenders asking, how long can this really last? Oh no, oh why, now we are talking. They were slipping through defenders like a hard knife through butter, keeping the ball close and showing impressive composure under pressure. The defenders are chasing shadows at this point, and the balls glue to their feet, like they've taken a masterclass in wizardry. Oh, oh well, this is pure artistry. They were weaving through defenders like a tailor with a sewing machine and the ball as have been thinking about leaving their side. They were so calm, you think they were having a cup of tea while casually strolling past the entire defense. The defenders are left dazed and confused, wondering if they've just witnessed a magic trick. Oh, look at her go. She's making those defenders question all their life choices. By the end of this run, they will be applying for new jobs. Oh, oh, she's dribbling through defenders like they are not even there. Honestly, at this point, she could dribble past airport security without setting off any alarms. Oh, wow, the defenders are trying, bless them. But she's out here like she's playing a private game of solitaire. Just her, the ball, and a lot of confused faces. Oh, wow, she's dancing through the defense like a ballerina on fast forward. You almost expect her to take a bow and ask for a standing ovation once she's done. Oh, wow, well, I hope those defenders brought their GPS because they are officially lost. She's turned them inside out, upside down, and left them in another postcode. Oh, wow. She's dribbled past three defenders like they were holograms. I am not sure if they primed to tackle her or politely offering her the ball back. Oh, wow. At this point, you have to wonder if the ball is controlling her. It's like watching a magician who has made the defenders disappear and reappear somewhere far, far away. Oh, wow. I'm pretty sure I just saw one of the defenders turn to the referee and ask if they can switch to a different sport. It's getting ridiculous out there. Oh, wow. Is she dribbling? Or is this interpretive dance? Either way, the defenders are mesmerized, and all I'm missing is some dramatic music to complete the performance. Oh, wow. It's like the ball is her pet dog, loyally following her wherever she goes, while the defenders just chase after like they are trying to catch a stray. Oh, wow. She's made those defenders look like they are moving in slow motion and i'm pretty sure i just saw one of them check to see if their boots are tied together oh my god wow she's gliding past the defenders so effortlessly it's like they've agreed to let her through in exchange for autographs after the match Oh, wow, I haven't seen dribbling like this since I left my dog alone with the hose pipe. The defenders are slipping, sliding, and she's just strolling through like she's out for a Sunday walk. Oh, my God, wow. The defenders have formed a search party to find the ball, but she's already left the building. At this point, I wouldn't be surprised if they start asking the crowd for directions. Oh, my God, wow. She's weaving through defenders like a seamstress with a needle. By the time she's done, we'll have a new line of football-inspired fashion on the runway. He's a masterful dribbler on the pitch. She's a masterful dribbler on the pitch. They were a masterful dribbler on the pitch. Well, they are trying to move with the ball at pace, but it's more like watching a toddler chase after an ice cream truck every time they pick up speed. The ball's bouncing away like it got somewhere else to be. The defenders don't even have to tackle. They just wait for the inevitable fumble. Oh my god, why has this been allowed? They've got some pace, but it's like trying to sprint on roller skates. Every step feels a bit wobbly, and the ball is one bump away from heading out for a throw-in. The defenders are closing in fast, and you can almost see them thinking, Mount your patience, the ball will come to us soon enough. Oh my god, why has this been allowed? They were moving quickly with the ball, and while it was not exactly flawless, they were managing to keep it under control. Mostly, it's a bit like running with a shopping trolley. You were getting there, but there's a wobble every now and then. The defenders are getting close, but so far they are hanging on. Now that's some impressive movement. They were sipping through the defense like a cyclist, weaving through traffic, keeping the ball close and avoiding tackles left and right. There's the occasional stumble, but they've got the control to recover quickly. The defenders are looking more like spectators than participants at this point. Somebody stop him. Absolute poetry in motion. They are flying past defenders like a gazelle on a racetrack. And the ball, it's not going anywhere except exactly where they want it. Tackles are flying in, but they were dodging them with ease. Like they were unlocked the cheat code for perfect control at top speed. The defenders might as well be chasing a shadow. Somebody stop her. Oh dear, they are trying to run with the ball, but it's more like they were chasing after a runaway shopping cart every time they pick up speed. The ball just slips away, and the defenders barely need to lift a finger. It's doing the work for them. 
they've got some speed, but the ball's acting like a mischievous puppy. Every time they think they have got it under control, it's off again. The defenders are hanging back, knowing they won't have to do much to win it back soon. Somebody stop them. They are moving well, though you can tell they were working hard to keep the ball in check. It's a bit like trying to carry a full tray of drinks while running manageable, but any sudden move could spell disaster. The defenders are closing in, but they holding their own. For now, somebody stopped them. That's some slick footwork. They were darting through the defense with the ball stuck to their feet like glue, dodging tackles as if they've got eyes in the back of their head. The defenders are starting to look a bit desperate. It's like they were chasing after the last bus home and it's just out of reach. Wow, just wow, they were tearing through the defense like a hot knife through butter. The ball never straying more than a few inches from their feet. The defenders are diving in. But it's this, like trying to catch smoke. Effortless dribbling at top speed, and they have left everyone in the dust. Uh, they're moving with the ball all right at the speed of continental drift. At this rate, the defenders could stop for tea and still catch up. The only thing they were penetrating is their own team. Patience, retain the ball under pressure. Well, let's just say the ball has a better chance of retaining its dignity than they do. It's slipping away faster than their hopes of ever getting past a defender. You have to admire their dedication to turning dribbling into an art form, an abstract one, where the ball is wherever it wants to be, and defenders are just figments of their imagination. The only thing getting past here is reality. It's like watching a performance of Amjan, The Great Escape, except the ones locking themselves up every time they try to run. It's like their legs are having an argument with the ball. No one's winning this fight, penetrating past defenders. Please, they couldn't even penetrate a wet paper bag. At this point, the only thing they're running past is their own bad decisions. The defenders might as well set up lawn chairs and watch the show they're for trying to dribble at speed. But it's like watching a clown juggling while running from a bear, shot it unpredictable and almost guaranteed to end in disaster. The ball is practically begging to be rescued by the nearest defender. Ah, the art of ball retention, apparently a mystery that you've yet to solve. Under pressure, the ball's as loyal as a cat at dinner time. Gone the moment it gets uncomfortable. The defenders aren't even tackling. They were just collecting donations at this point. Look at them go, moving at top speed. Well, relatively speaking, if top speed were a comfortable jog, that is, the ball might as well be waving goodbye. It's about to be handed over to a defender with a thank you note attached. Oh, they really giving the defenders a workout mainly by letting them tackle so much. If they keep us up, they'll have defenders writing them. Thank you cards for all the free possession they've been gifting. Moving with the ball is clearly an adventure for them. Every sprint feels like a lottery and spoiler a lot. The ball never wins. They've become an honorary member of the Defenders Club at this point. They've got such a generous spirit letting defenders in every time they try to penetrate the defense. I mean, it's almost charitable at this point. You've got to admire their commitment to making sure no one misses out on a tackle. You can tell they really care about ball retention farm, just not when it takes on the field. Under pressure, the ball leaves faster than a politician, avoiding tough questions. The defenders are practically writing thank you speeches for all these opportunities. Oh, brilliant. They're making the defenders look like they're auditioning for a slapstick comedy. At this point, I would be surprised if the defenders started looking for the ball under their shoelaces. Total domination. Well, someone forgot to tell the rest of their team. It's not a one-player show. They are out here putting on a master cast, while the rest are just trying to figure out which end of the pitch they were supposed to be on. It's almost unfair. They are dribbling through the defense like a ghost, gliding through walls, leaving the defenders grasping at thin air. You half expect the defenders to start questioning if they even exist in this dimension. It like they were playing a completely different sport to their teammates, while the rest of the squad is still figuring out how to lace their boots, they were out there conducting a symphony with the ball, and the defenders are just there for comic relief. They caught tearing through defenders like a chainsaw through butter. At this rate, the opposing team's going to have to file for witness protection. Honestly, the defenders should just sit down and take notes. There's nothing left to tackle. They're outpacing the defenders so easily that the rest of the team might as well be playing in slow motion. In fact, I'm starting to wonder if they've secretly replaced their boots with jet engines. If the defenders are trying to stop them, they've done a fantastic job of hiding it. Every move is so clean, so smooth. It's like watching a professional dodgeball player at a beginner's picnic. The defenders, they are just extras in this highlight reel. They were so far ahead of the rest of their team in ball control. It's starting to look like a solo expedition, while the rest of the squad is fumbling with basic passes. They were out here turning defenders inside out, and wondering if anyone else got the memo. At this point, the defenders have probably submitted a formal complaint to the league for emotional distress. They haven't had a sniff of the ball since kickoff. I think they were just here for the consistor now. You have to wonder if the rest of their team is watching in awe or embarrassment. While they're threading through defenders like a needle, their teammates are over there trying to remember which way is forward. You've got to feel for the defenders. They came here to play football, and instead, they have signed up for a masterclass in humiliation. It's getting to the point where they might ask for a written apology by the end of the match. Honestly, the rest of the team should consider asking for a refund on their training sessions. They, being completely outclassed by one of their own. It, like watching a world-class chef try to cook in a kitchen full of microwave dinners.
I don't even know what the fuck I'm watching anymore. You've disoriented me so much. I feel like I am drunk. I think it would be more pleasant to rub my naked body on a desert cactus than to watch him dribble. I think it would be more pleasant to rub my naked body on a desert cactus than to watch her dribble. I think it would be more pleasant to rub my naked body on a desert cactus than to watch them dribble. You know what pause the match. I need a shit. I really wish they would hurry up with this match. I am dying for a shit. Dear God, why are my bodily functions so regular? Why, oh Lord, did you curse me with needing a shit at this particular moment? Oh, the humanity. The snake is peeking out of the tunnel. Dear God, how am I going to hold this shit in for the rest of the match? I'll say it, I'll say it. His dribbling is absolute shit. I'll say it, I'll say it. Her dribbling is absolute shit. I'll say it, I'll say it. I'll say it, their dribbling is absolute shit. His dribbling is so good, it makes the rest of the team look like shit. Her dribbling is so good, it makes the rest of the team look like shit. Their dribbling is so good it makes the rest of the team look like shit. Oh, dear Lord Almighty, I would do anything if you answer my prayer. Please don't let me shit myself. I am absolutely dying for a shit. Stop the match. I am dying for a shit. I'll be right back.